Good morning. It is about 9:10 here in Cincinnati, Ohio. Um, we just got up probably about a 45 minutes to an hour ago. Um, we've been having very late nights um, because Savannah's feeds aren't ending till quite late, and so that kind of puts us going to bed pretty late. Um, Savannah woke up hungry this morning. I'm so excited. We just ordered her blueberry muffins, some yogurt, and fruit, and a cranberry juice. So, uh, it takes, they say 45 minutes. It seems to be like 30 minutes. So, pretty quick to bring it up. And I suspect they'll be pretty quick to bring it up this morning because they don't have to cook anything. The muffin's already made. They just have to kind of put it all on the plate and bring it up. And we get to order anytime. There's no time restrictions, which is awesome because a lot of hospitals. When it comes to ordering food, there's time restrictions for the kitchen. Um, one thing I have found that, unfortunately, is not a lot of calories. Ooh, my food almost fell out. Fortunately, it's not a lot of calories, but it's fluid. Is Savannah loves these drinks, and they are delicious. They're so good. And so, the first day here, we... Um, first day here, we drink, I, I'm not playing, I'm not kidding when I say probably four or five of these, like, we, they ran out. And so yesterday, they didn't have any. This morning, when I went downstairs to get my breakfast, I found them all restocked. So I grabbed her one, I grabbed me one. I'm sure I'll be going back down to grab several more in a little bit for the rest of our stay. Hopefully, we'll go home tomorrow. That is the hope. I really hope we do. Um, otherwise, she just took her morning meds. We're just kind of hanging out. Um, no big plans today. There's a magician that comes today that we're going to try and go see. Huh? Yes, I told him about how so excited you woke up hungry and wanted food. So, um, we're just hanging out, watching some TV, waking up. Uh, hopefully doctors will do rounds a little bit earlier today, but it seems to be they usually do them. They usually get over here kind of close to noon, so we will just see. So we will check in with y'all later. We tried to up her feeds, and we were doing well, but we are not as much now. It's going up. There's a secondary tubing that takes just like overflow. And she's been getting nauseous, not feeling well, and it's going up that. Um, especially every time new flu, new food goes through during that point in time. So I'm just waiting for the nurse to come in here to talk to him about her having these issues with the feet. Stay hasn't gone as well as we had hoped. Um... As of right now, they're still planning on her going home tomorrow. But that was this morning before they upped her rate for her, what they call her goal rate, which is the rate that they want her to go home on getting. And um, she hasn't done very well on it. She's had a lot of, a lot of discomfort, nausea, shaking. Um, and with the way her formula works in her, the bags, there's a separate bag called the feral bag. And that bag kind of, like, catches what they call overflow. Majority of the time, what it's for is for, like, gas and air that's trapped in the stomach. And it kind of burps the stomach, um, which has helped tremendously with her. But today, it has started to actually get, in the tubing part, a lot, quite a bit of her formula. Now... With that came the shaking, severe nausea, and pain. So we turned it off. We're turning it off for about an hour. And then we're going to try it back again. Now, she's supposed to be able to tolerate this amount and speed before we can go home. So I don't know exactly what tomorrow's going to hold for us with this little bump in the road. Hopefully she'll, when we turn it back on, we'll tolerate it better. And we'll be able to just restart it and go from there. So that is where we are. And it is 
almost 6 30 at night we have literally been in the room all day she didn't feel like getting out of the room she really wanted to go see the magic show today but she just didn't even feel up to getting out to go to that um so that's kind of where we are. That's why there's not really been any taping today, and I don't know how much there's going to be by the end of the day, because it's literally just been in the room all day. So um, we will touch base with you before we go to bed tonight and let you know how she's doing. Otherwise, um, we probably won't see you till then. Guess what? Today we're going home. Um, so, yeah. I'm excited. Um, so yeah. Well, thank you guys. So. Oh, so a lady came in and gave me a massage today. It felt so good. And so, yeah.